Mr. Chaudhary, I feel actually having met you and and chatted with you, that's really being myopic. I think there's a lot more you're doing, which I think I want to discuss that. One is the foundation. You know, the Chaudhary Foundation is doing a lot of great work, especially in light of the earthquakes in Nepal. I want you to expand on that. Well, I mean, all of us know that today Nepal is facing yeah. a challenge of a magnitude which Unimaginable. You know, nobody, nobody can imagine. It's far bigger than yeah. the size of our capability. It's yeah. far bigger than what we can handle. You know, 10,000 people died. Displaced. That's also official numbers you never know. Probably hundreds of even it could be even thousands couldn't even be rescued they're still probably hidden somewhere under the debris 700,000 homes completely damaged and unlivable six to seven thousand schools and I'm, I don't want to even talk about the infrastructure and but these sir, are in you know the very difficult very difficult territory these are mountains you know the monuments the homes the beautiful heritage you know, Science, uh, architecture yeah. that I've seen growing. The culture growing of Nepal, up, the ethos, I saw yes. crumbling down right in front of my eyes. So it's, a, it's, a, it's a huge emotional setback. It's a huge physical setback. So we, we as a group, I mean, you know, it's, it was not a matter. It didn't take us an iota of a second for us to decide that this is the time when we have to put together whatever we have yes. in terms of our ability to mobilize our own organization and people and friends both in Nepal and abroad and get into the task. Stage one was relief. Our own family members were going to different villages and mountains. Wow. Stage two That's was amazing, working sir. on construction of shelters. Mm -hmm. So we partnered with uh, Seeds, it's a mm -hmm. INGO which is also doing good work in mm -hmm. JNK and mm -hmm. Uttarancha yeah, yeah. Okay. to build these mm -hmm. transit homes, homes which are called yes. shelters. Okay. Which is still yeah. usable for three four years oh, wow. at a cost of about seven to eight hundred dollars yeah. per piece yeah. and we brought in price waterhouse foundation you know because i mean you know seven hundred thousand homes even if we are going to do yeah. ten thousand yeah. and hundred schools that's mm -hmm. tip of an iceberg yeah. so we need to mobilize the international mm -hmm. community mm -hmm. and i'm also taking the opportunity of your show wow. to share this with your it's audience it's too important exactly. you know to, 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 yes. to come and team up yeah. I mean, you know, we are not looking for uh, any kind of a credit. Right? Mm -hmm. Credit will go to who does it belong to. to correct, Price correct. Waterhouse House is yeah. there to define the processes and yes. to, to make sure that it's all our that money as well as exactly. the money of others goes are well the, spent. Exactly. Well okay? spent and goes in the well right Well spent reason. and goes in the yeah. right direction. So yeah. I think mm -hmm. this is something Collective effort, which, yes. where, which is taking a lot of my personal time, the time That's of my family. Wonderful. And I think we made a serious progress. That is you know, I'm so happy to share with you. Yeah. Perhaps the first lot of the homes will be delivered in next two weeks' time. That's quick. Yeah. Less than yeah. two months. So, so because we want to do it as many homes as possible before the monsoon creeps Wonderful, in. Wonderful, Mr. Chaudhary. That mm -hmm. is really something to feel so proud about. Thank and you. so happy. That's Thank amazing. You. And I'm so happy that, wow. you know, it was, yeah. um, I mean, we that could you participate. Do, we yes. could, you know, the foundation can, is doing great work. Which we're being recognized. This initiative is being recognized. Yeah. Jack Ma from Alibaba. Dot com. He wanted to partner with us to build 1,000 homes. Yes, I read up on that. I mean, so there are, I mean, I'm going on the 14th to Hong Kong. There are two events being organized by the media community as well as by the business community. And they want me to come and talk and share. Because everybody, you know, yeah. this is, this is seen the level of polarization, the level of culmination of okay. sympathies and desire to yeah. work. Never before. Yes. Can you believe China and India having joined hands, hands to build hands, Nepal? Yeah. I, I can't get over your passion for this. I mean, that itself is so riveting. Amazing. Really, I'm. I'm That's so. Just so beautiful. But I'm also conscious, you know, just for having said all this, mm. what we've been able to do or what we are doing yes, is yes. peanuts. It's a huge challenge. It's a huge I think it's gone. Task. People yes. ask me that, oh, what's going to happen to business or what's going to happen to new investments. Yeah. My answer is that, look, Nepalese people are very resilient. We've seen setbacks one after the, the other. other. You know, we've yeah, seen right. the fall of different political regimes. And the, the, the monarchy. We've <laughs> seen the fall of, you know, the whole palace, palace. whole royal family being killed or whatever. Yeah, getting chills. Okay, yeah. we've seen the Maoist insurgency Correct. for 15 years. Mm -hmm. We've seen 
the rule change swing from a monarchy to yeah. a Maoist led government Gone in the back parliament. To a bit of a demo democratic but Nepal has come back. Yeah. Nepal has that, and I have every every hope that this is going to bring Nepalese back together into a united nation. You know, a country which is cohesive, which is going to work with the world and take Nepal to the next level. Mr. Chaudhary, with you at the helm and with you guiding, I'm sure it's going to be that way. It has been one of the most riveting, inspiring and motivational interviews ever. We wish you all the best, Mr. Chaudhary. Thank you so much. In and all I must your say present and future endeavors. One of the most uh, pleasant and one of the most rewarding experience for me too. Thank, Thank you. you, because you've done many interviews. I take it Thank as, you. as an honor. Thank, Thank you, you, sir.